Good morning. My name is Becky Happy. I'm Chief Mission Officer for Providence Sacred Heart Medical Center. And it's my honor to welcome you all to this historic moment at Sacred Heart in the Mother Joseph Room, where we will begin vaccinating our first caregivers against COVID-19. As is our tradition at Providence, let us begin with a reflection. In 1856, our founding Providence sisters, under the leadership of Mother Joseph, survived the tumultuous ocean voyage. The sisters made it from Montreal, Canada, to Vancouver, Washington, finally, against many odds. But the challenges went over. They faced language barriers and the wildness of the Wild West. But landing on dry land, that was the beginning of their new beginning. Let us remember today our pioneer sisters who cared for people during outbreaks of typhus and cholera, the Spanish flu and polio. Let us remember our pioneering scientists throughout our country who toiled in labs, researching, testing, and it led us here today to this historic moment where we are vaccinating our fearless and first frontline caregivers. Vaccinating them against COVID-19, a virus that oppressed us and pursued us for nearly one year not just us, but our entire world. The challenges are not over, but divine providence, thank you for this beginning of our new beginning. Amen. And now, Elaine Couture, our regional chief executive and fearless leader, will say a few words. Thank you, Becky, and uh, thank you, first of all, for all of you that are here today as we begin our first vaccination clinic. Uh, this truly, truly is a blessing that we have been given and a gift that has come to us to go ahead and really relieve us from all of this pandemic that we've been uh, faced with over this last year. And I want to tell you that it's been an honor um, to go ahead and lead through this pandemic. I never thought that I would end my career um, with the pandemic in its, in its wake. Uh, but I really want to say that everybody, every single healthcare giver, whether you're working in housekeeping, whether you're working in pharmacy, respiratory therapy, uh, laboratoriums, physicians, the list can go on and on, have been there when we've seen some of our patients start this nights, and we have been a beacon of hope. Today, this gift that we are going to be able to give to our caregivers is a beacon of hope. And it's a hope that next year is going to be a much better year and we are going to return to the way that we've all experienced life in the past. And Dr. Ojoko, thank you. Dr. Ojoko has been up all night performing a kidney and pancreas transplant. And um, so thanks for coming in and, and being uh, here. But you know, he represents many of our caregivers who are on the front line, not only taking care of COVID patients, but all the other patients that we're seeing too. So it really is an honor, Dr. Jumbo, to be able to administer this vaccine to you today. So Dr. Jumbo, before the shot, I would, we would like to know how you're feeling in this historic moment. It's indeed a, a very historic moment. Uh, as a physician, you know, as a person of color, I'm very, very aware of how this virus has devastated our community. This vaccine is really the way of hope that's going to lift our spirits and help us defeat this virus. I really encourage everyone to get vaccinated so we can defeat the virus. So thank you. Thank you.